Hello, welcome back to this channel. <laughs> Why am I the way that I am? Uh, I have a stitch fix for you. This is a special stitch fix. I have it themed to Taylor Swift. <sighs> Gotta clear a few things up ahead of time. No, I did not get Taylor Swift tickets. I tried. I think we all tried. And if you succeeded, I honestly am very happy for you. We just so happen to be getting married in Nashville the exact weekend she's in Nashville for three different nights and didn't get a single one of them. It also jacked up all the hotels, which I, you know, didn't get one until after she announced she was gonna be there, which is wonderful for my, technically my mom's wallet. Uh, okay, and second thing to clear up is my makeup is way too dark for me and I know that and I'm not gonna try to get too close to the camera because it is really bad up close and from afar. I'm trying my best to wear uh, my mediocre version of Taylor Swift makeup so that's why I look like this and no this is not my first time wearing lipstick but it looks like it. Let's get in. I asked for one thing from Stitch Fix and that was make me into Taylor Swift. Today, Taylor Swift, I specifically said not country Taylor Swift, and that's all I said. Fun fact, I originally tried to get a trunk club, not a stitch fix, because I love trunk club, but you know, it no longer exists, which I did not know that up until last week when I ordered this. So we're doing stitch fix again. I used to do this a lot, and now I never do it, so we'll see how this turns out. I'm not convinced that it's just a computer picking out my outfit for me. So I'm wondering if there is a note. I know Trunk Club always like wrote a cute note and I don't remember if Stitch Fix does that or not. It is full and I see fluffy things in here. Is that Taylor Swift? You guys are gonna have to help me because I think of like classic minimalism when I'm uh, thinking of Taylor Swift outfits today. So. My goal is to keep one thing because I have $20 invested into this box and that is going to go away if I don't get something. So depending what the prices are, I basically told her to go wild. It's really packaged nice. Whoever did this did a wonderful job. Wow, I think there's a dress bag in there. Okay, let's open. I am wearing PJs right now. I'm sure you already figured that out because I did not get dressed yet this morning. Style number, I do picture Taylor Swift wearing sweaters, so. Ooh, whatever brand this is has like a metal tag on it that just looks expensive. This is cute. This is by Barber, I guess. And it's a sweater and it has a zip and it's brown and pink. I don't have anything in my closet that's pink. Wow, this looks very expensive though. So we'll see. We'll see how much it is. I see you, this is cute. I'll try them all on in a minute. The next thing we have is another beige sweater. It's tie-dye by Pistola. Also cute. Yeah, I'm not hating this. I don't, I still don't know. Is this Taylor? I think that last sweater was, I'm not sure if tie-dye is her thing, but I could be wrong. I did see a lot of like pictures, 2022, uh, Taylor Swift wears a lot of oversized sweaters and um, jeans. And also just like sweat outfits, which that's what I live in right now. Hello, baby. Asher's over here on the couch. If you hear baby noises, by the same brand of Stola, these are soft. It's a pair of jeans. They're oversized and they look really comfy. I um, updated my pants to a 29 because I'm pretty sure that's what I am now. And these look like they're actually gonna. I hope they fit. Maybe I'm a 30. I don't know. We'll see. I think I'm like an 8 now. Okay, this one is what I, I originally saw and I was like, that's fluffy. Let's open. What is this? It looks comfy. What brand are you? Free People. I love Free People, but one thing I know about Free People is that this is probably going to be like 150 bucks. <laughs> it's cute though. I wish it were black. Hmm, okay. Okay, I don't know, is that, I'm gonna say this whole video, is that Taylor, I don't know. Uh, oh, okay, oh, 
So the last thing, is that the last thing? One, two, three, four, I guess five things, that five items now, there's no jewelry or anything. Um, it's a pair of shoes and they have them in this little dust bag that says Stitch Fix. I thought this was like gonna be a dress cause like I can only see a little bit of it on the bottom. I guess that makes sense with like shipping. It's cheaper to put them in a bag versus a box that creates a bigger box than. These are Dulce Vita. I love Dulce Vita. And they're just a pair of shoes that look really big. My feet grew half inch. I think I'm a nine and a half now. These might be a 10. I'm not positive. Okay, let's, I think that's it. Let me just look at the card real quick. Um, and then we're gonna go on the try on portion, which, which should be really fast. That's literally only like, what? One pair of pants I have to put on. <laughs> I want to see if they wrote a little note on here. No, that's why I'm saying. Like, I think this is... Never mind, there is a note. I was going to say, I think it's a computer. Happy fall fix day, Brittany. It's not fall. Welcome back to Stitch Fix. I will be on the hunt for Taylor Swift inspired pieces. Great choice in the light wash, pistola, high rise jeans. Oh yeah, I did pick the jeans and the shoe. She gave me a preview and I picked those things and I said... Uh, scratch everything else and put them in. Um, it says these Entren light wash jeans feature a slight distressing, blah, blah, blah. We don't care. Uh, pair them with these boots, of course. She wrote stuff about the boots. She said put the sweater on with the jeans. I'm going to. Uh, okay. No, I think, okay, it says it's Mary. I think it's just a computer because there's nothing in here about like, Taylor Swift would love this or I picked this because of this. You know, Trunk Club would have done that. Okay, so let's put it on. My hair and makeup looks so stupid with this. This is outfit number one. Do you know that meme where like, I don't know what to do with my hands. I don't know what to do with my body ever, so. Um, I love these jeans. These are so comfy. They're a little big, but in a perfect way to where they fit like they're supposed to, I think. Um, they don't cut in whatsoever. They are, like, not stretchy, but they're that material that they're just so soft. It doesn't, I don't know. I like these a lot. They're not very flattering. Like, they're not. They're loose, baggy, like, mom jeans, you know? But... I am a mom, and I like how they're loose. I think it's because everything is a little tight on me <laughs> because I don't have stuff that fits anymore, and that's maybe why I like it so much. Um, I, I don't know. I like them. I really like this oversized sweater. It does make me look 20 pounds heavier, but I don't really care. <laughs> uh, the boots also fit wonderful. I love the boots. I don't love this outfit as a whole. Like, it's not, like, super cute, but... With that being said, uh, even how it is all right now, it's 100% better than what I'm typically wearing on a day to day, which is just a sweatsuit, so usually mismatched. Um, I love this. Can I afford any of these pieces? I'm gonna say no. If I had a job, yes. But I'm a stay at home mom, and we're living on a teacher salary for three of us, so. Uh, Let's go into prices. I wish that I would have specified cheaper, but I probably wouldn't have liked it as much if it were cheaper. So the jeans are the Charlie High Rise Straight Ankle Jean by Pistola. Never heard of it, like I said. Um, and they are a size eight and the color indigo for $87.99. Actually, I think they're worth that. The, this, <laughs> hello, the jacket. The beautiful jacket is in a size medium color beige for $98. It is $50 less than I thought it was. So is that a steal? And then the shoes are by Dulce Vita. And they're in a size 9.5 in the color brown for $130. Dang, really? Ugh. Don't know what I'm gonna spend my twenty dollars on. I guess at the moment maybe the jeans, or I'm just gonna call it a loss. I don't know. I really like this though. Next outfit. Make sure I don't get any makeup or lipstick on any of this. Okay, this is really. I've obviously the jeans and the shoes are the same. Um, 
Next, uh, it's very soft. It's my tie-dye sweater. Yes. Do you like this? And this is by Barber. No, Pistola. This is the Eva Crew Neck Sweater. This is in the color beige size medium, $148. What? This is the most expensive item? No, it should not be, but it is. Why? What is this made out of? Like Persian cat hair? <sighs> it's like just stress too. Like you're gonna put a hundred and fifty dollar price tag on this? What? Moving on. Sorry. <laughs> Aggressive. My hair falling out. Where's that supposed to go? Is that? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> okay, and I'm back. Back at it again. I need to put this headband back on. What is happening with this? Ugh, I tried cutting bangs into my hair. Did not go well. Okay. Anywho, last item. This is by Barber. It's kind of scratchy. This definitely has to be made from wool because it feels like it. Uh, the Jem Jemima quarter zip sweater in the color camel, size 8 or $89.99. Can you believe this is the cheapest sweater in there? It does not feel good though. Okay, so that that's my stitch fix. Wow. Um, wow. Hmm. Hmm. Everything comes to $553.98. If you use the buy it all discount, which if you buy it all, you get 25% off, it would take off $138 and make it $395.48. No. Okay. I'm not disappointed in this. I am not. This is my fault because I didn't put budgets on there. Uh, what I will say is that I'm not sure if I'm going to keep any of it. So I think I might just call it a loss and do the, I don't know, maybe the jeans, if anything, maybe the jeans, um, or just call it a loss and send it back. Cause $20 is really just for shipping for them, right? So it's not that big of a deal. I don't know, I really like this box. I wish that it weren't so expensive. <laughs> like even if um, I was a counselor right now and we had a dual income household, I still, I still know I would not spend that much. So I'm not going to say this is a loss. I think this was a good box. I think that maybe, I don't, I still don't know if it really screams Taylor Swift, but I think it did a good job in like finding things that I like. Um, yeah. So let me know what you guys think I should keep. I really need to decide within the next day or so and maybe you'll see me wearing something in an upcoming video or maybe you won't because I don't keep any of it <sighs> normally there'd be like a piece of jewelry in here that'd be like $40 and then it'd be like oh I only have to spend $20 more and I'll just get that but there were zero accessories so can't do that this time let me know though because this was fun doing like instead of saying dress me up for a date night or something giving a style icon so if you want to see a different style icon box it could be anyone it could be someone from like alexa from schitt's creek i don't know let me know who you want to see in the comments and we'll do another one of these in the future i love you so much gotta go hang out with this baby and i will see you guys soon bye oh merry christmas if i do not see you before then i will have better makeup or no makeup next time okay see ya. Too much, just your simple love and